This is Johnny with Rudomatic here at 3045 Attridge. We're looking at the sewer main, the um, city main. We're looking at the tap into the city main. Let's see. We've got some. Some of the side of the pipe has been kind of. There's a hole here in the side of the pipe where I believe we pulled out some roots. Oh, you know what? I'm going to locate this spot real quick just so that we've got it. Okay, so we got this spot located in the street. You can see the, the hole in the side of the pipe there. We were able to get most of the roots out of this area. It was completely blocked the first time I ran the camera through here. <clears throat> Bit more roots there at 44 feet. A little bit up there on the ceiling of the pipe at 42. That's stragglers there. There at twenty. And here's where it transitions at fourteen or twelve, thirteen. There's that Orangeburg pipe here. Ovaling. Let's see that pipe's all folded over. Collapsing. I'm gonna I've got two clean outs here, one going up towards the house. So I'm just gonna get it on this video as well. The, uh, the spot where we have the break in the line. So we're just a couple feet back from here. Cast iron pipe, and about four feet back. That's where there's the break in the line. You can watch the other video to see it from the other direction, but root ball there and <clears throat> break in the line. So that needs to be trenched out and replaced, replaced as well. Anyways, any questions? Well, no, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna shoot in a little further and just see the rest of this. Get a good 
it's there. Bottom of the pipe. I don't know if that's grease buildup or what. You usually don't see the bottom of the pipe missing on cast iron. Decent. But definitely need to take care of the broken pipe and at least the orange bird. Thanks for watching. Give me a call. Any questions?